I want to talk you through the controls on the front of the ATAG boiler and how to use them. All are really simple to use. Firstly, let me show you the digital display. If the tap is showing, it means the boiler is ready to produce hot water. If it's flashing, the boiler is currently heating water in response to a tap being opened. On the right hand side is the radiator icon. This will always be on. However, you'll notice it flash when the central heating is on. If the flame is showing, the internal burner is on, heating up the hot water and the heating for your house. Now, if the spanner or bell icon appears, refer to your manual. The number code will be visible on the screen, indicating a specific error. Use your manual to firstly identify what it means, and secondly, work out if you need an installer to come out. If you do not have a boiler manual to hand, you can download it via our download section of our website. Next, let's look at the heating and hot water buttons. The tap scroll buttons allows you to adjust the temperature of your hot water manually. Plus increases the temperature the boiler heats it to and minus decreases it. But you should know that the lower the number, the greater the energy efficiency. The radiator scroll button allows you to manually adjust the temperature of your central heating. Again, the plus increases the temperature and minus lowers it. By default, the boiler is set to comfort. This is where water has been preheated and is available quickly out of the taps. However, by switching to Eco, the boiler goes into economy mode. This means that water won't be preheated and you will need to run the tap a number of seconds before the hot water pulls through. 